Okay, so you got a publishing company, you started it, you registered it with ASCAP, BMI, whatever, you got the bank account set up. How are you? How do you collect money? Um, well, again, we talked about it before on the income streams, which are the mechanicals, mm -hmm. which are physical record sales, performances, which go through ASCAP and BMI, uh, which are radio, TV, and then the sync, which basically the performance, this is a little confusing, the performances from the sync will go through ASCAP and BMI, but the sync fee you will collect directly from the source. So let's go through that really quickly. When you're collecting money, you have your own. You have Chasing Change Publishing. Mm -hmm. uh, you got a big hit on the radio, ASCAP and BMI. You, are you an ASCAP writer or BMI? BMI. Okay, so Chasing Change is a BMI publishing company. Mm -hmm. So yeah. BMI will collect money for your share of the publishing, for Chasing Change, your publishing company, and Steve Kirk is the writer. And that money will be paid to you quarterly by mm -hmm. that Performing Rights Society. And then my company goes directly to whoever's, like, whatever movie's using the song and gets the sync fee directly from the source. Well, right? if, you, if you're if you talking about a sync fee now, what would happen is, let's say that, um, I think before we use the example, So You Think You Can Dance. Mm -hmm. uh, so You Think You Can Dance calls up uh, your publisher because you have a co-publishing deal. Mm -hmm. And I'm assuming your co-publisher is the administrator. Yes. Which means he's the decision maker mm -hmm. for you and him. They call him up and say, oh my gosh, Chasing Change song, this song called... Call You Mine. Call You Mine. Oh my God. We... Horrible name. Well, Horrible name for one, but yeah. No, no, no. Call You Mine. It's great. We love this song. We want to use it with uh, this dance routine we're going to do, blah, 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 blah. And your, your publisher, your administrator is going to say... That's awesome, great. Uh, well, how much? How much are you going to pay? They negotiate a rate. Let's say it's for the sake of argument, five thousand mm -hmm. dollars. So that five thousand dollar check will be paid directly to your administrator. Okay. He will keep the pro rata share and pay the monies out. And that's again, that's part of the beauty in being the administrator. He gets to collect the money. And pay the money out. That doesn't mean he's going to keep money that he doesn't deserve. It just means that mm -hmm. he never has to worry about getting paid because he's going to collect it all. Totally. So on the sink, the sink's going to come directly from the TV show, the movie, whatever. And then we have the money also from Harry Fox. Harry Fox will collect your money, your mechanicals. If you have an administrator on Call You Mine, your administrator will... Harry Fox will write him the check. He'll keep his share. He'll pay me. Pay, and he'll pay you. And then, you know, he'll pay the writers as well. If you're the only writer, that's it. Nice.